Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another brand new video. I hope you guys are all doing well. So in this video, I want to give you guys an update on what's happening with Bitcoin and of course the entire, you know, cryptocurrency market. Um, so we saw yesterday, okay, just last night, okay, a couple of hours ago that Bitcoin was in fact pumping um, above $26,000. Okay, we saw Bitcoin break this resistance line okay and it did in fact continue to pump up above twenty five thousand dollars and at some point it did actually touch twenty six thousand dollars around twenty six point three thousand dollars now bitcoin did in fact have a little rejection okay and in fact dropped below okay below this resistance line right now okay so right now bitcoin's currently at you know just below twenty five thousand dollars okay twenty four point seven and honestly it's still holding up pretty well Okay, it's understandable, guys, right? Bitcoin literally yesterday, right? It pumped up over, you know, 16%. Okay, so it's understandable, right? That Bitcoin right now is in fact, you know, having a little rejection. You guys understand, every time we see a decent pump up, a massive pump up, right? It's always going to drop back down. And that's exactly what Bitcoin is doing today. Okay, so Bitcoin is obviously um, dropping back down. Okay, potentially people are in fact taking their profits and whatnot. That's why it is in fact dropping. Okay, but you guys understand Bitcoin in my eyes is still holding up really, really well. Okay, so the real question here, guys, is it time right now to buy Bitcoin? And, you know, first off, I want to say, you know, we should have already been been buying you know not even just buying but you know investing and of course accumulating into bitcoin when bitcoin was way below 20 you know thousand dollars okay for all the people out there you know that's watching this video right now if you invested into bitcoin okay at any price below 20k so if you bought bitcoin at nineteen thousand dollars eighteen thousand dollars you know sixteen thousand dollars even fifteen thousand dollars congrats okay congrats because that was potentially the best time to buy bitcoin okay it really was guys and right now you would obviously be up in profit now not to brag or anything like that guys okay and i have proof okay i invested almost twenty thousand dollars into bitcoin when bitcoin was effectiving right around here okay when i saw bitcoin below sixteen thousand dollars okay and it went all the way down to about you know, $15,800, I saw that as a opportunity, a huge opportunity to buy Bitcoin. And you know what's crazy? In that video at that time, when I was buying, um, um, you know, a whole bunch of Bitcoin, right? At that time, when I invested heavy, right? When Bitcoin was at $15,800, I said at that very moment, this could not be, you know, this potentially could not, you know, be Bitcoin's bottom. I know that, right? Because you know, if you guys have in fact been watching my videos for a very long time, right for the past few months, then I've been telling you guys that, you know, I see Bitcoin dropping to at least fourteen to even $12,000 to even $10,000, okay, potentially, right? It could happen. That's what I said a couple of months ago. So that's what I said when I saw Bitcoin dropping, but I just had to take that opportunity because Bitcoin was dropping really hard that day, okay, which was last November, okay, last year, November. So I took, you know, that opportunity, a huge opportunity to see it as um, a time to, you know, buy Bitcoin because it was fact dropping, everything was dropping, even old coins, okay, and I didn't fact buy. So if you guys bought Bitcoin any time around here, okay, and who remembers, right, from November to December, Bitcoin was not moving at all. Bitcoin was pretty much stuck at $16,000 and guess what, if you did in fact buy a whole bunch okay at this time you'll obviously be up in profit right now you'll be laughing okay you'll be laughing right now guys okay so you guys have to understand you guys should have been buying we all should have been buying bitcoin when bitcoin was at you know twenty thousand dollars you know and bitcoin was obviously at twenty thousand dollars a couple of days ago right literally okay and then we saw bitcoin for the past few days absolutely rallying up okay we saw bitcoin rally up um early this morning even last night yesterday and of course even the day before that okay bitcoin just kept on continuing to rally up so if you bought bitcoin when bitcoin was in fact dropping right here okay and you bought bitcoin at twenty thousand dollars right here okay that would have been a great time to buy some bitcoin okay and you guys have to understand like i said right earlier if you bought bitcoin at any price lower than twenty thousand dollars okay that was literally the best time to buy bitcoin but what about right now 
okay for the people out there that's watching this video right now and you guys missed the opportunity on buying bitcoin when bitcoin was at you know 15 to 16 thousand dollars right down here maybe even eighteen thousand dollars or twenty thousand dollars right around here okay you know is it a great time right now to buy bitcoin because we know like i said bitcoin has in fact been pumping up you guys can clearly see that right it's been rallying up so you know is it a great time to buy bitcoin and personally i think it is right now okay is in fact a great time right now to buy some bitcoin why because you guys understand we're still in a bear market and i forget if i show you guys the weekly time frame here for bitcoin you also see from bitcoin's um previous all-time highs okay it's all-time highs to where we are now you guys can clearly see we are still down a lot bitcoin is nowhere near its previous all-time highs which is almost seventy thousand dollars you guys have to understand we're still in a bear market we're still in the accumulation stage so i think right now is still a great time to buy some bitcoin okay it really is guys and i really don't want you guys to miss this opportunity okay i really don't so that being said um bitcoin is still holding up pretty well it's still at twenty four thousand dollars. ethereum is holding up really well as well okay it's currently at seventeen hundred dollars holding up really well okay at that price level um and the global uh crypto market cap right now is currently at 1.1 trillion okay so now we are above 1 trillion which is great and today it's um pumping 2.1 percent and a lot of old coins are still holding up pretty well okay you know we saw a couple of hours ago um literally yesterday right a lot of old coins including bitcoin of course was in fact pumping like crazy okay and today um everything is still holding up pretty well you guys can clearly see that it's still a green day for the cryptocurrency market okay it really is so that's obviously um you know great to see so i want to show you guys a few charts right here okay now i'll show you guys a fair few charts um just like this one and i'm a big believer of you know history repeating itself so as you can clearly see um it looks like bitcoin could potentially right repeat um or you know what happened in 2019 right so back in 2019 you guys can clearly see okay we had a pump up okay and was a fact you know having um a pump and then a dump and then a pump and a dump and then it absolutely rallied up okay so we could potentially see that again for this year in 2023 okay you guys can clearly see that it's a bit different compared to you know 2019 okay um because we had this massive decent uh drop down okay and that's when obviously a lot of banks were in fact collapsing and whatnot a lot of negative things were in fact happening in the crypto space right who remembers okay um and that's what caused bitcoin to drop but then we continued to rally up and we could potentially see a continuation of bitcoin to rally up because i told you guys this many times right for bitcoin you know if i see bitcoin break above this resistance line then bitcoin could potentially right pump back up to twenty eight thousand dollars and thirty thousand dollars creating a new all-time high for this cycle for this year alone in 2023 right so you guys understand even though yes it did in fact have a little rejection bitcoin is still holding up pretty well and bitcoin could potentially you know consolidate it could you know go on the sidelines for the next few days but then eventually it's going to bounce back up that's just personally my prediction right and that is what the chart is showing here you guys can clearly see right it's pumped up okay and now it's consolidating a little bit having a little dip and then boom okay it's gonna pump up so we're gonna see okay time we're told but we will see and like i said i'm a big believer of history repeating itself now the bitcoin halving is happening really really soon okay really soon right um so next year 2024 guys the next bitcoin halving is going to happen then okay so be excited for that and i told you guys this many times every time we have a halving right the halving event for bitcoin every time that happens we tend to see bitcoin you know pump like crazy same with old coins the entire crypto market pumps okay every time we have the halving event and that's literally right around the corner and that is when guys right the year 2024 which is right around the corner next year that is when the next crypto bull market will in fact begin it's not going to happen this year in 2023 it's going to happen next year okay it's going to happen next year guys not this year but you guys can see throughout um the previous um halvings right you guys can clearly see that bitcoin always reaches a new all-time high okay always right and then of course it drops a little bit and then boom it jump um jumps back up right so every time guys every time okay we have the halving event 
Bitcoin tends to reach a new autumn mark. And that's why, guys, I really, you know, do see Bitcoin reaching $100,000 easily. Okay, easily creating a new autumn mark. It's not even going to stop at 100K. It's going to go way above 100K. I think Bitcoin personally is going to, you know, reach, you know, hundreds and thousands of dollars i'm talking you know maybe even 300k we could potentially see a 300k bitcoin in the next crypto bull market call me crazy but i'm being dead serious guys okay i really do believe in that maybe even 400k right but i don't want to push it okay i don't want to push it too hard but we will see time will tell but be excited guys okay and you know since the next halving event is going to happen around march next year or i think april or may somewhere around there okay um, in between those months, between March and May, if you really think about it, you have one year left to really buy Bitcoin at a cheap price. And of course, these other old coins. OK, even though, yes, everything is, in fact, pumping up right now, it's still cheap. Old coins right now, in my eyes, is still dirt cheap. OK, I'm being dead serious, guys. It's literally dirt cheap in my eyes. Same with Bitcoin, right? Um, you know, imagine trying to accumulate you know, and invest and buy into Bitcoin when Bitcoin's at 100K, comparing it to now at 24K. You don't want to miss that opportunity, guys. Okay, you really don't. Right now is the best time to buy Bitcoin, even though, yes, it's been pumping. But I think personally, it's a great time to still invest into Bitcoin and crypto, um, especially for long term, right? So that's just personally, you know, my opinion. So be excited for the next Bitcoin halving, guys. I'm obviously personally excited as well. Okay, I can't wait because it's literally right on the, around the corner. And obviously I am dollar cost averaging right into Bitcoin and Ethereum mainly, and of course other altcoins, but Bitcoin and Ethereum are in fact my two main investments, okay? So now checking this out. So we know banks have in fact been collapsing, okay? Been shutting their doors and whatnot, just gone bankrupt, okay? And this guy, okay? Um, tweeted out banks suck use Bitcoin or in and you guys can clearly see he purchased pretty much one full Bitcoin okay one full Bitcoin and this is exactly what I want you guys to do okay I really want you guys to really purchase at least one full Bitcoin because this one full Bitcoin will potentially make you wealthy in the future right I told you guys as many times one Bitcoin can potentially go for literally not $1 million. That's easily going to happen. I reckon it's going to reach, you know, tens and millions of dollars. Of course, I'm talking long term. I'm not talking short term. But you guys can understand Bitcoin will eventually reach, you know, $5 million, $10 million per Bitcoin and, you know, 15 to $20 million per Bitcoin. Of course, like I said, I'm talking long term, not short term. Okay. And this is why I've been begging guys to accumulate and hold at least one bitcoin and store it somewhere safe i highly suggest you guys you know to put it put it in a hard wallet right and just store it somewhere safe and just forget about it okay but i've been telling you guys as many times even in yesterday's video right banks have in fact been collapsing okay and i feel like a lot more people are in fact you know realizing and you know realize where bitcoin is heading and what bitcoin was potentially made for right so people start to buy Bitcoin while banks are collapsing. OK, Bitcoin is pumping. Think about that. OK, so you guys have to understand Bitcoin was created for all this. OK, this is the purpose of Bitcoin to keep your money safe. OK, call me crazy. I don't care. OK, whatever. Right. But I'm telling you this right now. I've been treating Bitcoin like it's my own bank, like it's my own savings account. If you don't believe me, right, for the OG viewers out there, ever since I started this YouTube channel, I've been telling guys that many times, right? Treat Bitcoin like it's your own bank, like it's your own savings account, okay? Because I feel like banks nowadays, especially, right, for the past few days now, we know the news, right? What's happening with banks nowadays, it's collapsing and just going bankrupt, right? And just shutting their doors and whatnot. So it's not looking good, okay, at all. So that's why you buy Bitcoin, okay? Even stable coins, right? We know what happened a couple of days, uh, you know, a couple of days ago with uh, USDC. It literally depegged from one dollar, okay, and it went all the way down to about you know eighty eight cents, I believe, right? About eighty eight cents. So, not even stable coins is stable no more, right? So that's why I believe you guys should just 
put your money in Bitcoin. I've told you guys this many times, right? If you guys have, in fact, been watching my videos. But I feel like a lot of people are, in fact, doing this, right? Banks, okay? They're not putting their money in banks no more. They're putting their money in Bitcoin. And I feel like that's why we have, in fact, been seeing Bitcoin um, rally up, right? Because a lot a lot of heavy buying were, in fact, happening for the past few days for Bitcoin because people realize that they should be buying into Bitcoin, right? And they understand the technology behind Bitcoin and the blockchain, right? And of course, um, it's more safe, you know what I mean, in my opinion, right? Even though, yes, it's really volatile daily, right? Weekly, monthly, it's really volatile. You guys understand that, right? But long term, it's always shooting up, guys. Bitcoin is always um, shooting up, okay? It, it really is. So you guys will see in the next crypto bull market, just you wait. We're going to see a 200K Bitcoin to a 300K Bitcoin in the next crypto bull market. You guys wait, right? But yeah, I feel like a lot of people you know, are moving their money to Bitcoin other than banks, okay? So to end off this video, I found this tweet and it's actually really, really interesting, okay? It's really interesting. And this is why I don't want you guys to miss this opportunity on buying Bitcoin at uh, $24,000 because like I said, Bitcoin eventually will reach, you know, hundreds and thousands of dollars, you know, 500K, half a million to a million dollars per Bitcoin. And of course, millions of dollars per Bitcoin, okay? So this guy, tweeted in march 13th 2011 okay he tweeted just discovered bitcoin it sounds like an idea that could change the world okay this guy um you know discovered bitcoin back in 2011 obviously back in its early 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 stages okay that's when bitcoin was literally like at a dollar not even that probably a couple cents right 90 cents look at that okay per bitcoin think about it okay and this guy, right, a lot of people were in fact wondering, did this guy buy any? Did he hodl, right? Um, so this guy uh, replied and, you know, to this guy's tweet, did we hold sir? And the guy, right, Aram, I'm hoping I'm pronouncing his <laughs> name right. Um, he actually uh, replied back, said some, I do wish I'd bought more. So you guys have to understand what's happening right here okay it's happening now okay it's going to happen in the next decade bitcoin right now is coming at $24,000 in the next 10 years bitcoin's going to be way above way 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 above 1 million dollars call me crazy i don't care guys but you guys have to understand bitcoin will eventually reach a million dollars per bitcoin so please don't miss this opportunity okay you're going to wish you you bought bitcoin at 24k you got to you would have wished Right, you're gonna legit wish you would have bought more Bitcoin at twenty four thousand dollars. Think about that, okay? So don't miss this opportunity, guys. This is a huge opportunity right now to make life changing money with Bitcoin and crypto, not financial advice, of course. So please always do your own uh, research. But guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. I hope you guys all enjoyed it. I will, of course, keep you guys updated on what's gonna happen with Bitcoin in the next few days. So please, um. Stay tuned, subscribe to the channel if you guys have not yet already, and of course, turn on that little bell so you guys are in fact notified when I upload a new video. But guys, I'm going to go ahead and end this one. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Give a thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in my next video. Have a blessed day, guys.